Pisces, Pisces. Well, welcome back, my beautiful Pisces. I'm so glad to see you here. So, with that being said, before I get into this reading, I will be putting down some holy water. We're going to be doing a reading, of course. We're going to be taking a look at your past history with whatever situation. We're going to be taking a look at the present moment. I'm going to be taking a look at your current situation. I'm going to take a look at how you feel, okay? And then I'm going to take a look about whatever this energy is that's attached to you, whether it's a job, a person, place, or thing, cat, dog, giraffe, I don't know, whatever it is. I'm going to see how this person feels about this situation. And then over here, I'm going to get some advice. We're going to see what we can do, what you can do to help situate the situation. And the last and seventh card that I will pull will be the final outcome of the situation. And I will clarify whatever I think needs clarified. So let's go ahead and get into this reading. Let's look at Pisces past history here. Show me Pisces past history here. Thank you. Okay. Oh boy. Present. Present history. Present moment. What's going on in the present? going on in the present moment present moment and the current situation current situation the current situation that you're in right now what current situation are you in oh brother okay how are you feeling here Pisces how are you feeling how are you feeling okay and how does this energy that's attached uh, to this situation feeling? How's the energy that's attached to you feeling? Okay. And what can you do to help the situation? Okay. And the final message here. Final message. Thank you. Okay. Past history, Pisces. Well, <laughs> it looks like you were involved in something here that you could have been, you were listening to the devil here, okay? So you could have been letting something hold you back. You could have been drinking a lot. You could have been in a toxic relationship. But this was in your past, so let's go a little bit deeper on Pisces' past history with this situation. Show me Pisces' past hit. No, we're going to grab a different deck. For sure. Yep. Past history with the situation that Pisces was in. Past history with the situation Pisces was in. Show me the past history with the situation that Pisces was in. Past situation. Oh, boy. Wow. This was definitely... You were involved... With a situation... Okay? Where it was... Seemed like it was all... Sexual... Toxic chocolate. Okay? That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> And it left you questioning everything. All right. Uh, and I feel like this threw you off balance. You tried to gain some kind of knowledge about it. But you definitely regretted doing this. And I felt like, I feel like right now you're just trying to hold back possibly from even seeing or speaking to this person because all you feel like this situation wants is something uh, that uh, I feel like all you feel like right now that all they're wanting is a good time okay but you are trying to move on but you keep looking back all right but you realize that the heartbreak here that you dealt was dealt with in this situation was much more than you wanted to carry so 
right now I feel like you're just trying to find your balance here. Try not to focus on it because I feel like you're waiting for something new to come towards you um, after a period where like you've shut down, but then you're going to start to feel good again. Your guard's going to come off. You're going to realize some things and you're going to start to realize that you are a big deal to yourself and you might face this person here and just tell them off, okay? So that's what I'm, yeah, well, that's what I'm kind of getting here. Like with, a, it's in the past, but you're also in this, this mindset too. So what's going on here in the present moment? So you're kind of like, I feel like in the present moment, you're still kind of hanging on to this energy over here. I do. You're still got this energy that's attached to you that you're still hanging on to. And in the present moment, you're kind of like, what do I do here? Do I, do I reach out to this person? What do I do? You're very reluctant, though, in the present. Let's, let's get into this reading here. What is, uh, what is this present situation? What's this reluctant energy here that Pisces is reluctant to do? You're reluctant. You're very reluctant. Very reluctant. Hmm. Yeah, you're talking to other people about this right now. You could be talking to a therapist about this right now, too. Whatever has gone on in the past, you could be bringing this up at your therapy sessions if you are in therapy, okay? Or if you are talking to somebody here, but yeah. It's like you're reluctant to almost entertain this situation, but you're talking to somebody about it. It's still in the back of your brain. It's like you want to do something, but then you're afraid if you do that it's just going to happen all over again. And I feel like right now you're want, not wanting to go through the same thing over and over again, even though you're, it's still on the table. You feel like it's still on the table. And you're like, oh, do I, do I, do I do this? Do I not do this? I need to talk to somebody about this. Maybe I just need to kind of focus on my house, my home, my money. Uh, yeah, and so that's kind of like where you're at right now. So it's like you're reluctant to even bring this back, whatever this is. You feel like you could bring it back. But it just might not be the best thing for you. So in the current situation right now, I feel like um, you could just be out doing your own thing, being with your friends. All right, let's just get a little bit more here on this current situation with Pisces. Current situation with Pisces. Thank you. current situation it's kind of like you're looking back here also in the current situation that you're in you're looking back at the past all right and realizing how unpleasant you had felt all right there's definitely that energy there you are going out with friends and doing things, but you're also looking back at the past and you're really seeing how impatient you were with the past and how you felt like this has started to become some kind of toxic situation. So how are you feeling right now? Ooh, Pisces. I think we're going to get into this. So I'm going to get into this a little bit deeper before we even. How's Pisces feeling about this current situation? How's Pisces feeling right now? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? You're shut down to this person. Whoever this is, you're definitely shut down. 
Because you basically, you've been struggling here, all right? And in the present moment here, like, you're struggling and it's bringing, it's bringing things over into your current situation. So it's like, this is all connected. You're bringing things over from the present, okay, into the current. And then it's like, how do you feel right now? it's, oh my goodness, Pisces, it's like, you're kind of closed off to this. You're starting to close off to this. Because you realize that this person, whoever this is, is very fickle. Very, very fickle. Oh my goodness, Pisces. Oh my goodness. Hi, Kitty Boom Boom. Oh, she's Kitty Boom Boom. Yes, she's a pretty girl. Okay. Okay. So, the energy attached to you. Oh, let's get into this person. Because so they're definitely showing up. The energy attached to you. The energy attached to you. Okay. This energy that's attached to you. Whoever this is. They're, like, wanting to see you and talk about possibly being more stable is what I'm getting. But how you're feeling, you're feeling shut off here. You're just feeling shut off. You, this therapist or this whoever told you to shut down off this energy, it looks like you're listening to... Whoever you've been talking to in the present moment where you're still reluctant about this person. Because in the past they left you confused thinking that it was just all passion. Which is, you're looking back at that right now in the current moment. Realizing how unsatisfied you were. Even though you're trying to get over this hump by kind of just going out. And seeing other people, talking to other people, uh, maybe just being on your social media even. Maybe you're just kind of like, I'm just going to get on social media and that's all I'm going to do right now. I don't have the energy to even deal with anybody face-to-face uh, -face, so I can deal with people on the social media because I don't even know if I have enough energy to even ha deal with anybody face-to-face. -face. So what can you help uh, with the situation here? All right. It looks like, Pisces, you're needing to... What you can do to help the situation is... Tell this person how you feel. I mean, if you, if you tell them... I mean, if you need to tell them off, maybe you need to tell them off. I don't suggest that. But you need to... Communicate here to this person, all right, and not have any expectations here on um, what they're going to respond with when you say whatever you need to say. I feel like right now, you, you there's something you need to say to this person. So maybe if that's like to speak the final thing, speak the final thing, all right? Or if that's maybe if you never told this person how you felt. Maybe you need to tell this person how you feel, okay? If you never told them. So this could go either way. It's because it's two Pisces, two fish. So, you know, I could be reading for just one Pisces or I could be reading for who two Pisces. I don't know, okay? So the final outcome of this situation is with the Magician. We're going to pull a little bit more in on that. With the magician. Thank you. Thank you. So basically, you just need to avoid any situations to where you may feel like you may be manipulated because ultimately that's going to send you right down the, the spiral again. Okay? So if you are feeling like you're being manipulated here, then I wouldn't, yeah, I would leave, I would tell this person they come back around to go kick rocks, okay? Or go pound sand, whatever it is. Um, 
Well, let's go ahead. Uh, let's pull. Uh, let's pull one more message for Pisces before I leave this reading today. Okay, we've got two messages. Okay. Be bold. Be brave. Love yourself, and don't be afraid to try something new. That's your final message here. So, if you guys enjoyed these styles of this style of reading. Uh, please let me know. It's very important that you do. You can do that by clicking that like button, commenting, of course, uh, sharing, subscribing. Uh, appreciate it, everybody that does that. And I really hope to see you on the next reading, baby. Bye.